Hey folks, welcome back to another episode of Horizon Forbidden West. I'm your host, Seaside, and right now let's go ahead and deliver the parts to the ladies and see what they can actually come up with. I know that look. You've got all the parts, haven't you? Here you go. Outstanding! I only need a few minutes to finish the prototype. I'll take the version that won't blow my arms off. Thanks. <laughs> Hi. So did you blow up any machines to get the parts? Or any bandits? You really like explosions, huh? Here we go. With the boomsticks? Oh, you betcha. Um, is it safe? Probably. Can I have one? No! Ah, uh, <laughs> cuz we're gonna make you something even better. Ba boom <laughs> Okay. Spike throws launch a powerful projectile that can hit enemies at long range. Due to the long buildup, you have a slow rate of fire and cannot be used while jumping or crouching. Spikes must be blown thrown at full draw in order to penetrate armor. Okay. So Let's uh, go ahead and equip this, right? Let, let, me, let me see how this goes. Inventory. Ah, here we go. Spike thrower. So let's go test this out. And in the meantime, let's go ahead and open up a quest and see what we can actually do for now. Uh, the Twilight Path. The Enduring. Oh, that's level 32. What the fuck? Oh, okay, I see, I see. Um, melee pits. Um, let's go do Twilight Path. Drink let's later. go test this out. I want to see how. Oh, oh, okay, I see, I see, I see. All right. It's going to do it. Oh, whoa, that's so cool. Oh, my God, dude, that is so cool. Dude, that is so cool. Okay, I'm gonna save this some, some other time. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm so sorry. Where's that workbench? Let me see if I can actually upgrade. If I could do any upgrades. That's not... And what level are we at? Level 7 right now. We got 12 skill points. Okay. So when we get to 15, we'll definitely spend them. Alright, very interesting. Yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna fall down there. I know I can actually climb up to this place. Oh, crap. I'm out, I'm out. Alright, let me see. See what kind of upgrades you can actually do for this armor. Um, increase assistances, yep. Ooh, nice. Thank you. And... Oh, we can actually do that. Level three. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. How about the weapons upgrades? So, let's see. Uh, great job. No, I'm good. Can I create a job? Let me see. And we got... Let's make a good job for that. We need a scrounger spark coil. Okay.
Hmm. Steed out for now. Hmm. I'm good. I'm good. We got a pouch upgrade. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Feeling pretty good. So, in the meantime, let's go down here. Uh, we got you fast travel there. Uh, let's see. A weave slot has been locked for you. Okay. Let's go ahead and install this outfit. Edit weaves. Uh, melee defense. Definitely. There we go. Can't ride that now. Need to get data from a cauldron if I can find one. All right, let's go over here. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Stuff. I should check all the machine carcasses here. Scrounge your spark coil. Okay, machines here. Maybe if I come back later or something. Um, I think we had to do this. Oh my god, it's on the other side. Okay. Oh my god, it's, you have to go. You have to talk to Tolly about this. I'm so sorry. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Um, here's Tolly. That's you. The machine hunter that bailed out the Karja. Never heard it put that way before. What do you want? Heard you've been hassling refugees up by the cliffs. Yeah, well, you heard wrong. There's salvage up there. A storm bird. Nailed it myself with a harpoon here in town. Not an easy shot if I do say so myself. It clipped its wing. And it crashed into the old tower up there. Killed it quick. Yeah, so if anyone's hassling anyone, it's the shadow cars of filth that's blocking the way up to my claim. And you're ready to crack some skulls to get to it? No need. It's a raggedy bunch. Probably all starved before I have to lift a finger. We'll see about that. Oh yeah, we will, won't we? Now shop's closed to Karja lovers. On your blasted way. What a fucking asshole, we. All right. See, I wonder why he hates the uh, the Karjas that much. Maybe because the uh, the red raids with the Mad King stuff like that. But we have a new king now. Uh, he's very polite, very nice, very humble. 
See if we can get up there. Oh shit. Can we actually climb up here? No, we can't. We gotta go the other way around. Okay. Oh yeah, you can't beat this view. Damn, we really have to uh, go all the way around. Let's grab some uh, witch wood here. Thank you. stare. I hear some yelling. Those people are under attack. Hey! You up there! Aren't you gonna help? Not my job. I'm just what here to Damn. Down. Not looking good, folks. Still up? God damn, dude. More machines on their way. Get to safety. I'll handle the rest. Go, Lakasha. I'll help the Nora. Oh, this is hard mode. I forgot about that. Damn, dude. Always wanted to see the savior of Meridian in action. Oh, yeah. That's the last of them. Better check on the refugees. Guess the show's over. All right. This will make an interesting color for my armor. Damn, a lot of metal shards for sure. See how they're doing. Is it bad, Lokasha? Shh, now. Everything will be fine. Is everyone okay? Bruised. But not buried. Our order will live to see another day. Are you sure about that? We're no strangers to hardship, Nora. We've crossed half the Sundom with no more than the clothes on our backs. And as soon as our Sun Priest returns, our path will be clear. For now, we wait. Well, you're better off waiting somewhere else. Your people need shelter. There's a town east of- Chainscrape. Yes. We know of it. Savohar says it's not suitable for us. 
Who? Our sun priest. Our order has made it this far thanks to his guiding light. Okay, and where is this Savohar? He went up to the tower to meditate three days ago, and he won't come down until the sun shows him the way to our new home. The fallen storm bird is an omen, he said. And of course, it must be. I see. And how long do you plan on waiting for him? Until he returns. He will return. He must. That woman's insane. You're Shadow Karja, aren't you? We are the Order of Twilight. The difference being... When the usurper Avad killed his father, we fled with the Karja in shadow to Sunfall. Our lives there were... difficult. Savohar saw our misery, lifted us up, protected us from the corrupt priests and heartless Kestrels. When their rule ended, Savohar led us from the Shadowlands. The long night ends, and the setting sun will lead us to salvation, he said. And so he named us the Order of Twilight. We journeyed west in search of a better life. Why didn't you go back to Meridian? A bard is a patricide. We will not kneel to the likes of him. We must walk in twilight to our new home. Savohar will lead us there. Uh-huh. There's an Osaram in Chainscrape, Tolland. He wants the Stormbird up there. Yes. He was here just yesterday. A very unpleasant man, even by Osaram standards. He made all manner of threats. But we will not be intimidated. That's all well and good, but he's got friends. Sooner or later, his whole gang will show up. Sabohar will come through. He always does. We just need to give him more time. You're out of time, Lakasha. You need to consider packing up and- We won't leave him. And we won't let others disrupt his meditation. Well, they're going to try. Your priest, Savohar. You said he's been up there three days? His meditation can't be rushed. So he does this often? Meditating for days on end? Well, it doesn't usually take this long. But he will guide us through. He always has. We have faith. Sure, but shelter looks like a more pressing concern. Look at yourselves. Those machines nearly wiped you out. And Osram thugs are watching you, just waiting to strike. You're in danger here. You need to grab Savohar and get out. Our situation. This is the worst we've endured. I know we cannot stay here, but without Savohar to guide us, I, I don't let me up there. And I'll convince him it's time to move on. But his meditation. If he hasn't received his vision, he won't follow. At least let me check on him. If he's been up there for days. Yes. Yes, that is sensible, I suppose. Please, be careful. The trail up to the tower is falling apart. Savohar is strong, but it could not have been an easy climb. It rarely is. Sounds like a very crazy man. Let's we'll see what we can actually uh, do. Let the Nora pass. Is there anything up in here? Top. Part of the ladder. Akasha was right. The trail's in bad shape. Yeah. 
<laughs> I love this ability, I do. I really do. I think I can reach those beams if I jump against the cliff. Okay. Oh, I see, I see. There we go. Can I get some of that stuff? Thank you. Okay. Now how to climb higher. Man, this is some Tomb Raider shit right here. Ladder must have broken off after Sabahar passed through. I have to find another way up. Thank you. All right, let's see. All right, are we close enough? Good, I feel pretty tired. Oh, there it is right there, okay. Broken bridge. I may be able to make the jump to the other side. Oh. Oh, thank you. There's the storm bird. Getting closer. Where's the storm bird? Oh yeah, right there. Um. Shit. That's where you came across. Machines. Savahar must have snuck past them. I'd probably slip past them. Or take them out. If I find where these machines are made, I might learn how to override them. That's a lot of blood. There's a long drop down here. No, we're still in combat. Oh, fucker! The fuck was that? That exploded? Fuck. Is it not going to be me that option? Here we go. For my stash later. And a lot of goodies around here, dude. All right. So there is a campfire right up ahead. Go 
We're gonna be quick to see about that. In pretty bad shape. The true sun above me. The true sun before me. Show me the way this even time. <coughs> the true sun above me. You must be Savahar. The true sun before me. Show me the way this even time. <laughs> No. No. The vessel must be empty for the coming vision. You don't need a vision. You need medical attention. On the way up, I saw parts of the trail had given way. Is that how you hurt yourself? My pain. All part of the ritual. You're hurt bad. And your people are running out of time. Staring at the Stormbird isn't solving anything. You don't understand the omen. It fell here at the peak. I just need to see the twilight. <laughs> My people will find their home. That is so sad. Listen, Makasha is doing the best she can down there, but machine attacks, angry Osiram. The Order is scared, Savar. The last rays of the eventide will burn away their fear. I can't believe they actually listen to this fool. Look at this. Oh my god, dude. What do you think is going to happen here? If you sit long enough, the sun will show you something. A path to a new home. A fallen machine can only mean that the storm has passed. <laughs> Salvation is at hand. Or some Osram shot it and hit an old tower. Pretty much. You punctured a lung. You can't heal it with prayer. The sun will provide, <laughs> and I will not lose faith. I'd be more concerned about losing blood. Your people are worried about you. They need shelter, security. The true sun above me. The true sun before me. Show me the way this even time. I think you've been staring at your salvation this whole time. The sun above me. Gotta get over to that storm bird. Grab its heart. Oh shit! A storm bird heart is valuable. Enough to feed all the refugees waiting below. And his answer is sunstroke and a prayer? Why does every priest I meet think blind faith is the answer to everything? Pretty much, right? Faith is a very strong, ignorant um, obsession, in my opinion. Thank you. Oh, there is something down there. see any way up so let's go back around um I'm trying to see 
see. Ah, oh, there is something up there. Yeah. The Osram that was watching the refugees probably went to get Tolland. I gotta get them out of here before he comes back. There. The Order should be able to afford shelter with this heart. Some food and a change of clothes wouldn't hurt either. And then... Guess I'll figure out what to do with it later. Sabahar? How you holding up? I need to get back over there. Savar? He's dead. Stubborn old I man. You the best you could. Rest easy now. I'll make sure your people are safe. Oh, man. I should let Lakasha know. And give her the Stormbird heart. That is so sad, man. We... So we're going to get past the 30 minute marker. So what we're going to do is going to go ahead and uh, go ahead and call in an episode from here on. Sorry about that. My words are like, bleh. Um, like I say, thank you for watching this. I really appreciate the time. I'll see you guys later and take care.